What's up? My name's Nick Devine. I have a reasonably small shirt on today, but that's not what we're here to talk about today. Our friends over at AugVape sent me over one of the new Oculus, the new colors. I'm actually vaping an Ocula now. I quite like the vape. I got it on my Saint Mech Mod from Times Vape with the Ocula. Ocula is a RDA made by AugVape and twist it messes. I have a review, a full review of this RDA over on my YouTube channel. Go check it out. Can't put links in Instagram because it just doesn't let you. It's not because like, they're going to take my money. No, because they just don't let you. They just don't. I don't know why. That's stupid. They should change it. But anyway, here's the Ocula. I have not even opened it. They sent me a blue one. Um, I've seen Gunmetal, I think I've seen Heat Treat It, and I've seen, um, I forget the other colors I've seen, but now they have a bunch of colors of these Oculus. Um, they vape really good, gotta put them coils high, but what I'm gonna do today is show you me opening this, show you what it looks like straight out of the box, and then I'm going to install four coils into here that I did over on Coil Clays. So I have a five core Alien and a two core Alien both sets and I'm going to install both of them inside this RDA. Now what's cool about me receiving this one is I received two Oculus from AugVape. They were both um, they were both you know before resale versions and they didn't have a single coil so now I'm excited to have this one which should and it does have the single coil option. I can't wait to try that out because it seems like a really good RDA to have a single coil option for. All right, I just noticed that my camera is facing the wrong way. It's going like this, I want it like that, but I don't edit these, I wake up like this, right? So here is the Ocula deck. It's a nice deck, it's got huge post holes, huge post screws. And once in a while, the camera does focus. Once in a while. Let's get some more light. We're going to have to edit this video. And did an O-ring just come off of that? did but hopefully it doesn't happen again it does have Phillips and flathead screws and you know what we're gonna go down now and just install these are super smooth everything on this is machined very nicely thumb screws and we're gonna leave them up and we're gonna go down and install these four coils all right all right it only wants to focus on my face so let's go down once again, here is the Ocula cap, nice and shiny blue, and this does have single and dual coil option. I'm going to close off the one side. Both sides are closed off. Now this side is going to open, and that side is closed off. All right, concave in there. Very nice cap. I love the looks of this RDA. And then here is the deck. You see I already have the screws open. Thumb screws. Phillips are flat. It's got that Ocula symbol on the bottom of the deck. It has the notches for the, the cap so it doesn't spin all the way away from your coils. And that's what the bottom looks like. 20,021. Okay. There it is. All right, let's get these coils installed. So once again, I have two sets of coils. These are five core aliens. I did over on more core alien or er, coil class, and then I have two core aliens. And I just want to install all four of these coils right into this deck. All right. So I do want to make these five cores at least one more wrap. They're five wrap now. So I'm going to take them. I'm going to put another wrap in, and I'm going to see if they fit inside the posts, 
and of course they're going to. I can do even one more and I'm going to. So now I have seven wrap. Now this build is not going to be for vaping. That is not what I'm worried about. This is more just for showing off. That's all. I'm going to bend this lead up like that. And let's do two more wraps in this guy. One, two. Bend it in the Y. Y. So I could bend it like this. Alright, I have a little bit of fraying going on right here. So let's cut that off. And then the other two coils, I'm going to keep them just as they are. Which they are six wrap two cores. Alright, and I'm going to bend the leads on these. And I'm going to install whatever coils I want in the bottom first. So I'm going to put these big boys down at the bottom first. Alright, there's one. I could cut the leads on him. Alright, I'm going to put in number two. Hold him in there. Cut the leads on that. Get him out of there. And sure, why not? Let's cut the leads on these as well. I may regret this. I don't know. I'm just winging it here. Trying to get this done in a timely fashion. Alright, so I got four coils here. And now what I'm going to do is I'm going to install the two big boys in the bottom. going to install the two little guys right above them. Get the leads into the posts as best as I can. Now it might not look pretty in the beginning, but I will get it. If it'll go into the one side, it'll go into the other side. Make sure all eight leads stay in there. And once I know all eight leads are in there, my fingers are kind of in the way to do the thumb screwing right now, which will happen if you're trying to do too much. So I'm just going to use the screwdriver. You can see things are looking a little messy right now, but I will get it. All right, abort, abort. I should have left them leads long because what's happening here is the posts push the coils down. This big coil's hitting the deck. It's pushing this up. There's not enough leads for it to get in there. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to install these five cores. I'm going to pop these guys out, and we're just going to get them five cores in there. Alright, 
so they are in, and if you're actually going to vape coils, which I'm not going to vape these most likely, they're probably just going to be for show, take a couple pictures, but if you were going to vape them, your best bet would be to lift them up as high as you can, so they hit the airflow a little better, try to get them a little more even. On the one side, it's not the cleanest looking alien right now. It's got a little bit of wonkiness going on from messing with it so much, but all in all, you get the point. Five core. I believe these are like 28 gauge that I did on the live video over on my channel. Seven wrap around a three millimeter. And that is the Ocula, now available in new colors like blue and gunmetal. Go check them out. I hope you enjoyed me messing up this build. This one's for the haters, I guess, so you could sit there and fucking laugh at me, I guess. I don't know. Everybody have a good day. I got another video to put up after this one, so stay tuned. Check me out on YouTube, like, subscribe, comment, all that good shit. Peace.